U.S. dollar pulls back against the Japanese yen only to find buyers. This is Chris taking a look at the dollar yen. The U.S. dollar has pulled back initially during the trading session on Friday only to turn around and find buyers as we continue to see massive interest rate differentials come to fruition. The 152 yen level underneath will continue to be a major support level and I think that as long as we can stay above there we are kicking off the next leg higher in this pair with that being the case i think you have to look at this through the prism of finding value on each dip and you have to pay close attention to the idea of whether or not we can stay above the 152 yen level breaking down below there would obviously be very negative but the 50-day EMA sits just above the 150 yen level and is an indicator that a lot of people would pay attention to. Furthermore, the 150 yen level is also an area that a lot of people would pay attention to due to the fact that it is a large, round, psychologically significant figure. Because of this, every time we pull back, I just simply add to an already existing long position that I have and collect swap at the end of every day. Remember, the Bank of Japan recently raised interest rates to basically zero. And although that is better for the yen, the reality is that the Federal Reserve may not be cutting this year at this rate. And therefore, this carry trade lasts much longer. I think at this point, we're more likely than not going to go looking to the 155 yen level. If you like the video, thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you.